What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Honey Bee, back to deliver another daily buzz for you guys. Welcome to my new subscribers. Welcome back to my returning subscribers and my day ones. Those of you who have been rocking with me from the start, I appreciate you guys also very much. Cross watches, you are welcome here as well. Let's go ahead and tap into some energy and see what kind of what, what, what's buzzing around my collective, you guys. Let's see what's going on. Um, let's see what's going on with the person on your mind. I'm here and I can't stay away. So someone is feeling like they, 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 they're having a hard time staying away from you or you are having a hard time with the separation or both. Give me a message of spirit. What's going on? What kind of energy is buzzing around my collective? This person may be a smoker. Um, cigars may be significant. Black and miles, like weed. Um, you twist it up in a cigar, right? What else? Okay, they told me get this day. Also. No messages, spirit. This person may be an Aries. Emperor energy is here. Toxic sexual energy. So this person may have what we call devil's dick. <laughs> they got some good sex. This person has a lot of passion for you, right? But it came out in reverse, y'all. So it's like this person is not only craving uh, passion. This person is passionate about coming towards you. Can't stay away. Music industry. This person may be an artist of some sort. Um, I hear sketching, formulating a plan, return to sender. Yeah, this person is wanting to return to you, spirit. Oh, spirit. Thank you, spirit. Yeah. You and I will make it through. Kissing you still gives me chills. So, yeah, this person is thinking about your lips. I'm there, they're, they're showing me a boomerang. Like this person is wanna come back around. They're wanting this to come back around. It says you and I will make it through. Uh, I hear get through the dilemma, get through the delay, get through the obstacles. What else? What else, spirit? What else? I just can't take the arguing anymore. So it's like a lot of back and forth. Um, making it through the tough times. This could be someone that you're with, right? And you and your person are just not giving, getting along at this time. The passion is about fixing it. They want to fix it. Someone wants to fix it. I will start putting you first now. If I move, will you move? Mm, I'm hearing, hey, let's get away. So maybe someone may want to run away with you. Return to sender. This person wants to come back. Also, remember to do your return to sender spells. Remember to do your return to sender, you guys. I'm hearing somebody may be throwing you in a cross. Like someone may be trying to in, in, interfere in your connection. Or they may be telling you something bad about your person. Or your person something bad about you in an attempt to get them from returning. Or in an attempt to get you to from forging a bond. I'm hearing the bond we want shared. So there could be a time that you and this person were close. I don't know if they're work or... I'm hearing con artists. This person got some, some shady people around them. Okay. They said that's enough of this deck. Enough of this deck. It's an attempt, y'all, to get this you and this person to close off to each other. It says, don't contact me. Sorry, I've moved on. Right? Hmm. What's going on, spirit? What's going on? What's going on? Ten of swords. Someone is feeling betrayed. This person could have betrayed you or you could have betrayed this person with a third party. Damn, that's here. Could be like a job situation. Okay, so say this this person could have chosen work or I'm hearing friends, right? Look, nine of wands. This is a wounded war, but it's in reverse. It's like this, this person or you may be holding on to the betrayal. Someone is holding on to betrayal here. It's almost like you're okay. So I hear like you're making it difficult. Like you're making it difficult for this person to return. They don't, but it could be they don't know how to approach you. Like this person just may not know how to talk to you. So this person may be waiting for you to come back towards them with this three of wands energy. This is waiting for something to come in. Waiting for your shifts to come in. Return to sender. Like this person may be waiting for you to return. If I move, will you come with me? This person is also wanting to move. I don't know. This could be moving in together or. Moving to a, a another physical location. 
travel is involved here this person may travel for work especially if, like they're an artist or something like this person may travel to perform or something there's something about it yeah six of wands this person has a a lot of attention i hear is the spotlight is on you you're the superstar tonight so you may have a lot of attention on you right now like people may be admiring you right here see right here this muse energy people may be admiring you at this time oh okay so um they feel like someone else has all your attention right this person feels like this person may also at this time be unstable like between jobs between work um there's something about your success here like this person may feel like you don't have time for them right look with the world being over okay this person don't know how to return to cinder I hear the damage has been done. Too much has been done. Aquarius, Scorpio, um, Taurus, Leo is here. Could be feeling with, dealing with a fixed sign. Don't have to be. The tower is here. Something unexpected. Um, this unexpected is like the ending. I feel like the ending was unexpected for this person. This person never thought you had... What is agility? What is that? What does that mean? <laughs> I had a gall. Like, this person didn't think you had the gall to actually move on from them. There's something about you being in a spotlight. You may have gained some weight. There's a notable difference. There's a notable difference to you, right? So, you're you're in... This person is used to seeing you as Queen of Cups... Um, now you're in Queen of Swords energy, like you're more logical. You're taking a different approach to life. It's like you're you're learning to handle situations without emotion. Uh, and then I heard come see the softer side of Seer. So it's like you put your soft side away. You took the soft part of you away. The the conversation between you and this person may be difficult at this time. It's like they don't know if what they're gonna receive, right? Uh, Five of Swords is here. Like it's, I, I hear like a battle. It's betrayal, arguments, tension. There's tension between the two. Five of Cups is here. There's regret. This person wants to talk to you, collective. They don't look the lovers with the Seven of Cups, but they don't know. This person is confused as to if you even want them back. I hear somebody say you're not, you're not checking for me anymore. Like this person is frustrated on the inside, and this is you, like the fool, happy go lucky. Um, put yourself where it fits. What does this person want to say to my collective spirit? What does this person want my collective to know? What do they want my collective to know? Ooh, I got a thing for you, baby, you know. Don't want to take it slow. I want to get to know ya. Don't want to play no games. Listen to what I'm saying. I got a thing for you. This person got a thing for you, collective. A king of wands, ace of cups. This person loves your ass, collective. Thank you. You got their attention too. They're a cup. This person is wanting to reconcile with you. They want to um, bring the peace. Look, King of Queen of Wands. This is your energetic match. This is could be a soulmate, high level counterpart, but it's hidden. This person is is. I don't want to say this person is scared of you, like fear, but this person, it it's intimidation because you're coming out as a Queen of Wands. And the Empress, you guys, and the Queen of Swords, right? This ain't nothing to play with. This not, this not, don't fuck with me type energy. Like, you know, this person may feel like, like little, like, like a peasant. <laughs> oh, three of swords. They heartbroken. This person is heartbroken. Why are they so hurt? Six of Pentacles. I feel like this person is hurt, heartbroken because you're not giving to them anymore. Because all they could do is watch you. Like they wa they could watch you. Like all this person can do is admire you from afar. Like the rest of the people in the crowd. This person can't reach you. They they upset because they don't have your attention. Look, Six of Pentacles. Because you're not giving to them anymore. You could have chosen a different direction. Um. Also, something about your successes here. Like something about your spot. You being in the spotlight. Um. King of Pentacles. They may feel like you too big like you know like somebody's like you too you know when you level up in life like <laughs> i heard forget about the little people they feel like you forgot about them this person feel little on the side of you like it's like 
this person could have had an advantage or upper hand in the, in the situation at one time, but it's like you leveled up. You're leveled up. It's like so. This person is coming in as the king of wands, coming up as the king of wands and king of pentacles, but you're you're tapping in as the empress, right? So it's like where this person felt like you may have held this person in a higher regard at one time. And they could have looked down on you like the peasant, right? Because this king of pentacles, he's looking down at this pinnacle. But now your level up has taken you to emperor status. So you you're, you have surpassed this person. And spirit is saying, that's a damn truth. I also hear, speak your mind. Like, you know, look, side eye, king of pentacles. And this person may be well off, well established and this and that. But this person is seeing you as the empress. And they coming in as king energy. This person feel like... The level up is astounding is what I hear. This person is wanting to come back towards you. They're upset that you have rested. You've put this situation to them to rest. Like you cut it out. The queen of swords. Yeah. This person is upset. They they feel some type of way because you're no longer stuck on them. Like this person wanted you to stay stuck on them. Like I'm hearing someone say that's mine. Like this person is like, almost like a possessive nature. So return to sender. So okay. So they, they wanted you to return to, to them. So say this person could have sent you packing, right? Sender. They would be the sender if they sent you. They want you to return to them. Well, ain't this about a bitch? This person is real arrogant. And they hide it. This person hides it. This person could have... Okay, because I saw Queen of Pentacles energy and I seen a, a King of Pentacles. And I know you're the Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords. This person may have a spouse... Or somebody that they're weak. Because the Queen of Pentacles showed themselves. But it's like Seven of Pentacles. I mean, I'm sorry. Seven of Swords to the Queen of Pentacles. Like this person may be trying to hide this from someone. I hear like pretend. They pretend well. This person pretends well. They pretend well. Let's see what they hide. It's possessive. Like your, like your mind. Look, this is why they're upset. Because you really let them go. Thank you for the confirmation spirit. This person is stalking you. They're overthinking at this time. And this person is fighting. It's fighting. The harder I try to resist you, the weaker I seem to, be, seem to be. And arrogance. This person is arrogant. If I don't get what I want from you, then I'll get it from someone else. Right? So this person could have maybe chosen someone because they thought it was a better fit. Or they felt like this person had more. Or, you know, hell, like this person is coming up as a queen, king of pentacles. And their person was coming up as a queen of pentacles. So they may have thought that the person they were choosing were more was equally yoked or better than you, right? You know, for y'all, that may be triggering. But this person probably thought that that was a better investment. That the person they chose over you was a better investment. But whole time, look, they missed a blessing. Because look who you are. The whole empress. Whole empress. This person is also upset over thinking that you're that you're dating online dating that you're back on the market. This person is reaching their, their breaking point. Look, pretending and verge. I'm pretending to be happy and that all is fine, but I'm miserable. I'm about to confess my true feelings. Please be willing to listen. This person wants you to listen. This person is also feeling some type of way because you shut them down. And they feel like you're the one that got away, right? You're the one that got away. I'll look for you in the next lifetime. So this person don't feel like you would take them back. This person also tries to communicate with you telepathically. And they also self-pleasure themselves to you guys. Mm -hmm. This person was in denial about the, the connection with you for a long time. It's much easier to deny my feelings for you. So when I say this person is hiding, they're hiding it. This person is in denial. And they may have to keep this under wraps because there's a Queen of Pentacles energy that's lurking in this person's energy. And I, they say, and I do mean lurking. So this person be looking. They be looking. Waiting game has been slow to return. I've been slow to return, but maybe it's because I know you'll be waiting. See what I'm saying? Return to sender. This person thought she would have came back already. Oh. <laughs> Y'all, this person is funny. This is someone who used to get in their way. This person is used to getting their way. This person is used to getting what they want. This person is used to... I hear manipulation tactics. This person is good at manipulating the elements. They, it's like they have a way with people. The way they talk and speak to people, that gets people to conform to what they want them to do. This is why this person is upset. This person has a sense of entitlement. This person is in, has an entitled energy. It's almost like I t they have an energy like I, I touched it, so it's mine. Right? 
and then they could put it on the shelf and just leave it there and come back for it or when it's ready or whenever you you know like it's almost like i hear a summon um whenever i i call you come god forbid you haven't talked to this person in two three months they expect after that hiatus um they could come back and they could say whatever it is that they that whatever fuckery is what i heard like because i'm just like the messages I was getting, like, it don't make no sense. Like, this person will come back to you with a with, with a tale that don't make no sense. And they just expect to pick pick it up, pick up where it left off. This person is entitled very, very much so. Hard to read. You confuse me. You give me mixed signals. You see what I'm saying? This person is used to you conforming. So, it's like, now they don't know how to approach you. This is how they why they don't know how to approach you. Because this person don't know what you're going to say. Also telepathic and hard to read. This person feels like the energetic core between you and them has been have been cut. It's like your frequency is so high. The inner empress energy outside of King of Pentacles, like you you your your frequency is high. Like you're you're vibrating high and this person can't reach you. It's almost like they feel like this person feel like they're going to have to level up to reach you where you are and this is also what intimidates them. I hear out of reach. So close but yet so far. Family, my focus has been on my family. They mean the world to me here. And this may be what you're focusing on your family. But like I said, there's a Queen of Pentacles energy lurking. And then right behind that is a Page of Pentacles. So you have King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. Right? This person is hiding their true selves um, because there's a, a spouse. There could be a kid, a, a middle-aged a middle -aged kid or a small kid, whatever. Or kids don't have to be y'all. This could just be them giving into another counterpart giving into their person but it's becoming hard for this person to bear it's good it's getting hard that that verge energy they, they're about to crack they can't take the waiting anymore this person has been holding back but you know what look see what i said this person is secretly trying to manifest you that's what i'm saying this person have a way with words like this person may do the thing like they may hold out they may hold back and let you come to them right or this could have been how the situation was in the past but this person has seen like this shit don't work no more it's like this person is trying to manifest you back okay so let me see what this person what does this person want from my collective if they're already in a connection what does this person want from my collective what do they want let's see what does this person want from the collective says I wish we could go back I wish we could go back this person wants to go back I'm hearing it'll all get better with time they do admire you this person is admiring you it also says I look I'm not available there's a counterpart somewhere else this person may be emotionally unavailable or unavailable to come towards you this is why they're waiting on you to come towards them you know what I heard reactive abuse reactive abuse is when okay um like somebody tells you something in an attempt to trigger you to get you to act a certain way so they can they could have the the, the pleasure of saying I told you so it's almost like hmm this person is manipulative as hell you and I were were too young so this may be someone that you met um when you were younger here we go i hide my feelings didn't i say this person hides it they hide it well listen this person got people fooled with that magician and that seven of swords this person hides it they hide it this magician energy here this person is trying to manifest you back also with tele telepathic okay and this is why they may feel like you're hard to read with telepathic it's like because uh they can't figure out why it's not working like it used to work <laughs> listen they slick that slick slide shit they used to work it used to work for them in the past but that shit is not working no more it's, it don't work i'm becoming a better person i think they want you to know they become a better person but huh I would do it all again this person wants to do over with you i feel you even though we are apart and you came closer than anyone because mm -hmm. it's like you don't you don't respond to this person the way everybody else does like you have a i don't like you hear you have a, a hat trick for the hat trick it's like you see this person coming <laughs> thank you spirit you see through the manipulation and this is just mean you came closer than anyone because you see you see this person for who they are you see what they try to hide 
I can't get enough of you. And this is what? This is what they want. This person can't get enough of you. Can't get enough. And it says, look, will you ever make things right? See what I'm saying? This person was waiting for you to come back towards them. And I can't reach out. I will wait for a sign from you. I want you so badly. I want to make amends. <laughs> I wish I had treated you better. I'm not I'm not laughing at your person, y'all. I know I messed up everything and it's time for me to heal now. So this is what it means. Oh, and I can't do this. When this person is saying I come, I'm I'm becoming a better person. I kind of sniggled at that because with this energy sitting on the table, it's like it's no way you be trying to trying to become a better person and you're still playing these manipulative ass games, right? Well, it's like it's time for me to heal now. I'm becoming a better person. And it's like I can't do this. This person is having a hard time with the healing with their healing is almost and I, I saw you inspire me so it's like you may be this person feels like you can help them it's like the nooks and crannies like you could get into this person's psyche is what i heard seeing beyond the bullshit seeing beyond the bullshit and i don't want to let you go this person don't want to let you go 21 12 on the timer y'all i want you back Huh. I'm hearing I did you wrong. 21 21 on the timer. I want you. I want you. I don't want to let you go. I want you back. <laughs> Listen, possessive, entitled. Like this person feels like you are for them. In spite of the fact that they have something else going on on the back end. I miss hearing your voice. This person means talk misses talking to you. And I hide behind material things. Like this person is they hide. But that's not saying you see through this person. Seven of Swords with the Magician, like you see right through them. Especially with telepathic and fighting it on the verge, like this person. Mm -mm. It's getting hard for them to deny what they know in their soul to be true. I hear souls calling. It's almost like their soul is calling for you. I hear you calling. Here I come, baby. To save you. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. Uh oh. Baby, no more stalling. What does he say? Hands or lips? These these hands have been longing to touch you, baby. This person also desires you sexually with this Aries energy. This is the Emperor energy. The Emperor came out, didn't he? This could like be like a boss or manager or high ranking in the community in their life. Ah, so this person is used to having their way. I'm hearing I'm um, bossy. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. But they can't boss you. This person can't boss you no more. Hmm. I hope this helps y'all see you on the next video.